Hey folks, Corey Arnold out here at Toyota Beasley. We're out here on the new car lot looking at Toyota 4Runners today. And we've got a good bit to choose from. So rather than just picking one out and kind of doing a video on one, kind of wanted to walk the line just to let you know what we have. First up is going to be 2024. By the way, all of these are 2024s. We sold our last 2023 about a month ago. So 2024 Toyota 4Runner. This is an SR5 model. So this is the model that's going to be the entry level, even though it's a very nicely equipped vehicle, even at the entry level. It does have cloth inside with no sunroof. This is a two-wheel drive. Now, let me explain why we added the 20-inch alloy wheel upgrade. I got to tell you, whenever you put a black 20-inch wheel on a 4Runner or a black 17-inch wheel, you make it actually go faster. If this car came in, even though it would be about $2,000 less, uh, it would actually move slower than with this wheel. So I got to tell you this, if you come to buy a 4Runner, uh, be in the market for a wheel because the wheel is really what sells them and what makes them move. That's a good looking feature there. We normally do a 20 inch wheel on a two wheel drive because you're probably not going to do any off-roading because if you're doing some true off-roading, you don't want to do that with a 20. You'd rather do that with a 17 inch tire. Case in point, let's go to the next car. This is a 2024 Toyota 4Runner TRD Off-Road Premium. So this is the one that's made for you to get out in the woods. And notice that we did a 17-inch tire. The reason being, the distance from the top of that rim to there, that's called tread wall. That's your friend when you're off-roading because you can air down just a little bit, which causes that contact patch. You get more contact with the road. Therefore, you're more capable as far as off-road goes. Now, this is the only one on this lineup that has the rear locking differential as well as the crawl control. So if you really need to do some uh, overlanding or some off-roading, this is really the one to buy right there. Uh, it really is the most capable of all of the ones on this line, TRD Off-Road Premium. Uh, it is also right now the most popular 4Runner at Toyota Beasley. It's the one that we actually sell the most of. Uh, even above the limited model, but just something to consider there for you to each his own. All right. Next up is a four wheel drive 2024 Toyota 4Runner Limited. OK, now the limited model is the one that's all about the look. Of course, you've got a lot more chrome on the front of this vehicle, a 20 inch alloy wheel with the machined and the black. And then we've got the light tan inside on this particular one. Now, these come in two rows of seats or three. Uh, this particular one, let me check it here. This particular one has got three, I mean, excuse me, two rows of seats on this particular one. White uh, is really probably the most popular color, but the gray is probably going to pass it. We've got a new gray, and you're going to see it a uh, second from the end down there in just a moment. Next up is going to be the sport model. Now, the sport model is about when you like the look of Unlimited, but we don't want to spend the Limited's money. Notice the hood scoop, and notice we've got the same wheel as a Limited. It's got a little bit different color pattern. But so this is kind of made to be a limited lookalike, but not near the money that a limited actually is. So it's a good looking car. It's been popular. So this to me is one that, hey, I'm not doing any off-roading, although this car is four wheel drive. So certainly capable of that. But I certainly wouldn't want to kind of get down in the mud in this particular one. To me, if, if there was a such thing as a city forerunner, it would be the actual limited as well as the sport model that we got there all right next up is going to be a four wheel drive limited in silver with the redwood inside uh so good looking combination there beautiful car let me check and see if we got two rows or three rows let me check it and this particular one has got three rows of seats okay so a three row limited uh silver on the outside with redwood inside uh beautiful car that we've got there Next up is going to be the second most popular color in the Limited right now, which I think it's probably going to become the first. That is the new underground gray. That is a Limited. Uh, gray on the outside, black inside. Uh, that's a good looking car. Four wheel drive. We just sold one of these and uh, this one came in right after we sold the first one. The first one, I bet, probably didn't stay on the ground, but about three or four days and we got it out of here. And I think this one is going to follow suit as well. It is a beautiful car, the new gray color. Notice there's not a lot of metal flake. Come up for me if you would, and the cameraman can show us. This is actually a metallic paint. So you see a lot of metal flake actually in that paint that's actually grabbing that light, okay? But notice here, this is kind of a cream paint. 
We don't have metal flake inside, so it makes the car look creamy instead of actually uh, that metallic look that we've got here. It's been popular. Uh, we know it was popular in the Lunar Rock. This is the new replacement for the Lunar Rock, by the way. Great looking color that we've got there. On the end here, we have got the last one is a SR5 Premium uh, two-wheel drive model that we've got. Again, two-wheel drive, 20-inch wheel on this particular one. So basically, the idea is we don't spend the limited money, okay? But we do want something with some styling on it. That 20-inch alloy wheel uh, is an upgrade with this XP package. Guys, got these cars here, ready for you to drive and take them home. I'm so glad the days are back where, goodness gracious, you had to come and order a car with a sheet of paper. Now you can look at these cars, drive them, and then take them home. Thanks so much. Come see us at Toyota Beasley. Have a great day. It's a beautiful day.